Hi guys. I'm sitting in my garden and you could wonder why. Why not? I felt like it'd be so fun to be right in the middle of God's creation. Anyway, unrelated to that, I have an amazing verse for you. Romans 5 verse 2 says this, through whom also we have access by faith into this grace in which we stand. Access by faith into grace in which we stand. So in the Bible, when it says in which we stand, when it talks about standing, it usually means persevering. Stand, be strong, persevere. So we need grace in order to stand. You know what I'm holding right here? I'm holding a subway ticket, a ticket from June 17th, 1994. And th we used this 28 years ago when we were in England to get on the subway. In order to get on the train, in order to get access to the train, I needed to use this. And in order for you to get access to grace, you need to use faith. Faith gets you on the train. Faith gets you into that place of grace where you can move forward. Thing is, I used this pass, or Paul did, one of us did, on June 17th, 1994. That was what was needed to get on the train. That was the faith that gave him the access to get on the train. I couldn't use this pass today. So I want to tell you every day, get access. Every day, have faith to get access to grace. Sometimes we go through hard times where we don't feel God's grace. We feel sadness or we feel like we're being swallowed up. A week ago on Saturday, we had to put our little dog, Mabel, down. And I, I knew it would be hard, but I felt like I got punched with grief. And it was so heavy and so hard. In that moment, by faith, I could say to God, I need your help, I need your grace. And by faith, I received his grace in the midst of something difficult. So God wants us to access his grace by faith every day, get a new ticket, so you can go through what you need to go through by faith according to the grace of God. I bless you, whatever you're in by faith receive his grace and he'll carry you through love you bye from my garden bye <laughs>